Greetings, sir and sirettes, and welcome back to Airships Conquer the Skies with me, Lathrix. And, of course, welcome back to the Lathrixian Riders on the hardest difficulty in the game. In today's video, we're going to go out and we have two major goals. First of all, we really, really, really need a brand new shipyard. At the moment, it's taking way too long to build anything, and it is really hindering our process. Currently, we have this thing, which I am still tempted to sell, even though we did reduce its maintenance and overall cost. It's still not really worth the maintenance and overall cost. It's a fine design, but it needs to be used in a bit of a swarm, since it's only bringing three muskets, and we don't really have the maintenance to do that. On top of this, we only have one derp dart left. Seriously, we need more shipyards very soon. But guess what? There's other things I really want to do. The first of what which is to destroy the Stone Guardian. The first of what which? The first of what which is to destroy the Stone Guardian. Now, I can't remember if this even gives anything, but the thing is, the Stone Guardian is really really vulnerable to ramming damage. It's one of the few monsters which are really easy to just hit and kill just in that way. So we are going to go ahead and do that. If it gives us anything, then it does. If it doesn't, then it will be a bit of fun. On top of this, people have been telling me since last season to go out and kill turtle doves. Now, I have a problem with this. As someone who has pet tortoises, sorry, a pet tortoise, I only have one. Eventually, I will have more. This is just too cute. But here's the thing. See that lovely green shell? It's armor. It's special armor. Apparently, it's decent for defense, and it gives a craft lift. Let me say that again. It's armor that gives lift, doesn't take it away, which means we can start building balloonless craft without using suspendium chambers if it gives us enough lift. Even if it doesn't give us that much lift, it will just help out so much and allow us to make much heavier designs in the future. So I'm waiting until... The Agile is repaired, because that one can actually shoot, and then we're going to go out and see if we can kill our enemies, and kill some turtle doves, which aren't our enemies, but happen to be made of armor. If they didn't want to die, they shouldn't be made of lootable resources. So into the game itself, and we are going to lose this. There's no real way around it. Yep, we have no defense. And same for you. Actually, no, we could send the Derp Dart here now. And we could send one derp dart over to here. Go forth, my lovely capturing vessels. You're attacking the cultists? That's fine. Like I said before, I am fully prepared to lose a lot of the territory we, we grabbed last time because I don't really have the defense for it. And I certainly don't have the maintenance to build gr uh, ground vehicles. Ground vehicles? Buildings? You know, those stationary vehicle things. <laughs> I don't have enough maintenance to build buildings all along this border, because we need them everywhere, and then the enemy would just skip it anyway. So you're still going to attack us, that's fine. It would be nice to grab one of these. I wonder if the Agile could kill the Turtle Doves by itself. I need something with regular guns, you see. So actually, capturing one of these enemies would be perfect. First fight? Um, okay, you're different. Are they heavy cannons or regular cannons? Are they regular cannons? Might be. Okay, well either way, go like there, so I can't dodge you completely. Ah! Goodbye, Ram. To the ground you go. Meet my borders. Welcome to the Legion. Ram backwards. <laughs> it worked. Now you serve the Legion and kill your brethren. For the swarm. How is there no target available? You can clearly see the enemy. Now, I could try to board again, but I think what will happen there is I will lose control of this in terms of fine controls. Is it worth it? Maybe. We could just keep on firing. Yeah, we don't have many um, crew members, do we? Hello? Okay, where is you? Okay, it's there. That is the supply hatch. I don't know if that would work. But it would be nice to grab both of these for the Legion. Sorry, for the Riders. Which is part of the Legion. It's a splinter group. Hello there, friend. You appear to be on fire, friend. 
You have no water. Oh, you'll burn out. You're fine. Um, hold fire so you don't run out of ammo and lose. Actually, no, you will be fine. You move, though. He's about to fall out of the sky. Whee! The infection spreads. Okay, you can go home and get repaired. That way, we can use the Agile and you as a nice attack force. Now, we could use two derp darts. Like I've said before, the derp darts will not work well together. But they are very scary to the enemy, as you saw. Okay, we now have the pressurized tanks. That is something I really wanted. But now, I really want the harpoon gun. If we are going to upgrade our boarding craft so they can be used multiple times, rather than taking so much damage each time, so in the other words, the derp darts final evolution, I would like a harpoon gun. I would also like... No, actually, just the harpoon gun would be great. Thank you. Then we have the grappling hooks here, which will allow us to get the other types of troop. Then we go all the way down here and decrease our troop maintenance cost. That's our goal at the moment. So you two... Do you think you two could kill one of the stone guardians by yourself? Maybe you could. Building more derp darts. Then I guess we'll go out on the attack. We could try and capture this guy. Okay, anyway. First shipyard, incredibly weak. That would be an easy take, as long as I don't defend. You are also very easy to take. Get behind and just board. So, wait until we have a derp dart and then do that. But first, Stone Guardian. You're much smaller. I could have swore it was much bigger than that, like a proper tower. Anyway, doesn't matter. Should have um, stayed far further away for extra speed, but still. It's pinky purpling us, lads! There you go. <laughs> Whoa! 12,000 monies! Are those doves still over here? Or have they been killed? They're still here, okay. Um, yeah, once this thing gets repaired, I'll send the two... Gun craft over, or I could try and get this first. I might try and get that first, actually. No, don't flee! Cowards! Fools! You two get repaired. Um, yeah, you two gunners then. You're okay, yep, good. You two can go over here and attack the turtle doves, which sounds really mean, but I really want those shells, and you can be repaired, and this single derp dart can go over here. Hopefully, the enemy will not try and defend. No, it won't. Although, you are being annoying. Hello! Whee! Oh, what am I doing? You have guns on both sides. Um, that was to scare you. Bit scared now, ain't ya? Body slam! Board, board, board. <laughs> Why is this silly craft so effective? Enemies hate him. I love doing that. Boarding, boarding, boarding. Welcome to the Legion. You left, I invade everything you took in the first place. Okay, now we definitely want to get behind this one. And I think we all know what I'm about to do as soon as I get over here. Hello. Oh, that did far less than last time. Oh well, borders. Ooh, you have guards. Aren't you a fancy muffin? No, fire! Thanks, Rain. Ramming vehicles are silly overpowered. <laughs> we are learning this in this, this season. That was so, so stupid. Also, I should have done a um, hostile take over there. Because we do want the shipyard up and running as soon as possible. You're about to invade me, you meanie. It's not like I would ever do anything like that. You know what, let's see if this works. Just go straight ahead. Full speed ahead, lads. Tree. I moved the building, which is worrying. Ah, capture it. 
If nothing else, we could always sell these later. And so we continue to be rich. In fact, I'm going to upgrade our secret police. And I'm going to go with Empire of Science. Where are my troops that are going over here, anyway? Where are they? God, you're slow. I think it's the... Where are you with... Okay, I don't want... Uh, I guess we could bring you. That's fine. You go and take that back from the enemy once they invade it. Hello. Oh, you're the same as the ones from the north, except for I've not been suppressing you yet. <laughs> don't worry, I will. Hello. You know, I want to just ram you to death, but apparently you're just not allowing me to do that. Now, I do want to be higher than you, otherwise the boarding might not work. Can you please let go, let go of me? Body slam. And now you have no fat. <laughs> you have no nothing. Hello. That was wonderful. Okay, you go there and get repaired. Uh, do you have a new derp? Oh, yes, we do. Let's invade some of their territory. Let's go to the island this time. Yeah, the island is not looking that well defended, honestly. Why am I so low when I have to avoid the trees anyway? Giving them a fighting chance, I suppose. This season's going to be one with just the derp dart, isn't it? Didn't mean to press brutal there, but I did. Where are you going, anyway? To invade one of my areas, or no? Wow, you're going miles away! Where are you going? To invade that? Sure, why not? Derp Dark, go and find out what's there so I don't have to send a spy. That would be nice. Okay, we have harpoons, so now we grab this, because I would need this for that. I'm never going to use them, but still. Oh, look, loads of those ones! The ones which can't fire upwards properly. Except for at the very start! Doopy doopy doo. I love how they all surrender. It's like, oh god, it's behind us. Nope, nope, not even gonna bother. Nope, we give up, we yield, you win, and thus we now have three of those. You're about to attack one of our places, so let's go and... Oh, okay, this is gonna be more difficult. The reason is, these have boarding crew. And fire! For the raiders! Yeah, okay, yeah, they definitely have more boarding crew than we do as well. You know what, I'd rather them destroy these. But they're not going to either, they're just going to board us instead. But yeah, I'd rather them destroy them because I was going to sell them anyway, and I don't want them to own them, so when we're fighting them, we're not fighting these defences. If that makes sense. What are you guys doing on top? See what I'm saying about boarders? They're not always um, the smartest of creatures. Come on, hurry up. There we go. I don't think we're going to win this. I think our best bet is to go straight forward, try and destroy their weapons, and then keep our borders inside of us, which sounds weird, as a, as a defense force. I was also hoping to get away there, because what I could have done... Darn it. Thank you. What I could have done there is got away before they landed. Okay, that one can't get the same altitude. I know it's silly sending in another derp dart, but... Okay, now you move away. Okay, yes, yeah, so now there's only a few of their borders, so we kill all of them. Darn it. Yep, yeah, this is a terrible thing. A much heavier boarding craft is now taking our borders. Okay, you get repaired. Thankfully, we have loads of them, and I'm going to do that again. I'm going to send them all against him, and I'm going to capture their boarding vehicle, and then that'll be our boarding vehicle. And the enemy are attacking us. Ooh, they've upgraded their ship! Cool! Look at the guns! I like guns. I'm going to take you soon. Is that Grenada? These have Grenadas, really. Why? 
Focus on their balloons. It's not the only thing you can possibly do damage to. I believe in you. Kind of. Oh, dear. It's a loose interpretation of believing in you, but believing you nonetheless. You still firing? Oh, you blessed little rifleman. They've run out of ammo! How did you not win that? Well, this happened. I'll wait until something happens then. Victory! Apparently. Are we close to the turtle doves yet? Oh no, they must have been killed before we got there! There were others down here, weren't there? Okay, do the same. Damn you. Enemy is attacking us, and apparently with a flamethrower. Could have moved. Decided against it. Well, my board has got in there. And then Lost versus their bridge. Because, of course, they did. Can we move at all? Well, we won. That's pretty simple. So I've decided I'm going to send a few more troops down here. The turtle doves have way too much HP. So I want to fight with, yep, some of the derp darts. Let's see if ramming works against them. I remember you guys. Hey there. I don't think you have boarding stuff. You just have that little um, Gatling gun. Right? Oh, hello. Well, either way, you're ours now, so we can find out later. Um, who's still fighting us? We're apparently not done yet. We've captured you and... Oh, yeah, these aren't our forces. If we flee now, though, we either get to keep that, which we did, or it gets destroyed. That's good. We get to keep it, and we can repair it. We are being invaded by the purple people. We didn't know it knew existed until just one moment ago. Uh, Derp Dark, get ready to defend against I don't even know what. Oh, you guys again. Okay. Neat. Oh, you do have a flamer as well. Stop knocking out my balloon. Wait, defeat? Grounded? No, no, look, I one shot and I would have won that. Game. You know that was unfair. I was is there any defense buildings? No, okay. That went well for both of us. Good. This time you lost fire being grounded. Being attacked from the north now as well. We've been attacked from everywhere. I haven't yet attacked the turtle doves since I am sending more reinforcements over there. I'll just wipe this one out. They will eventually win, but let's do some damage first, eh? They've run out of ammo. Really, guys? So we should, in theory, slowly win this then. Yep. Well done. A musket defender one. Oh no, apparently you do have ammo, you're just in a bad position. That's even weirder. Fire faster! Eventually victory. Good. Good. So our defense force has been successful. Uh, you, go and capture that. You all need to be repaired, so go ahead and do that. Down here, our reinforcements are meeting up. But first, let's do this. Now that should be quite easy as long as we get past their first wave of attacks. Hello. So, how are you? Do you want to surrender? There you go. It's like tag. Oh, we have very little money right now. We've made too many units. Okay, uh, you go and capture that back for us. You can all go and attack that. 
Yep, same as usual, just needs to get behind the enemy, so it's all, all line up so we can get there as fast as possible. None of you lag behind. Whee! Now if I do this, then maybe there, and... <laughs> tag, you're it! War tag. War. War never changes. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, not funny. Now, I know for a fact that the turtle doves sometimes don't give you the tech, they just give you money. I'm really hoping they give you tech. I don't know if there's like a difference when you attack them, but I'm really hoping they give me the tech. Since I've never been, well, I've never used it before, so it would be nice. I can't see any other turtle doves. I was hoping we'd get to the first one as well, so we'd have two chances. Well, here it is at last, attacking the turtle doves. Not exactly something particularly pleasant, but if we do get the armor, it is certainly worth it. So you three, just stay in formation, move forwards. The idea with you is not to do damage, it's just to hold them in place. Perfect. Okay, you two missed, but that's fine. Just move down. No rush, so I'm not using the ram command all that much until I need to. And there we go. Ow. But still, you get the idea. These guys are just trying to hold them back a little bit. All of you are in aimed fire because sadly, most of you don't have all that much ammo. So, just trying to reserve shots. I have killed these things before once when I was testing out a few things. And I didn't get the, the um, armor, so I'm hoping this time I do. I don't know what factors go into that. Do you need certain researches? Maybe. But the thing is, we're just focusing on sailors anyway, so we're not going to have armor research and such. So, if we don't get the armor, then we, we're simply never going to get the armor. Okay. There we are. Perfect. Okay, you go a bit lower. Shouldn't have overshot so much, but that's fine. There we go. Now they're stuck. Cruel? Yes. Effective? Also, yes. Well, just wait now until we defeat them, and let's see if we get the loot. Victory! And the third time trying to read this without stammering. Your Empire's engineers used the creature's suspendium-rich shells to create a new kind of lift-generating armor. The shells are harvested and stored in a military warehouse, and the corpses are left to rot. That's just mean. Okay, this is a bit weird, but this is being recorded after I just recorded the outro. As soon as I stopped, this fight started, so I do apologize for that. It's going to be a little bit weird. Anyway, let's see how this goes. I really want to capture one of these, so I thought it'd be best to keep it in the video, even if it's not in the right order. You go there, you go there, and I don't really want to start off the next video with this. So, one's captured. Can we capture the other one? These are, of course, from the islands to the northeast. They attacked our shipyard. Once again, they really don't like having many bridges, which is great for us. Yeah, they have one cockpit. Is that it? Really? Well, we now have more craft. Oh, also, I captured this island down here when I was about to attack the turtle doves and I was waiting for reinforcements. They got to mention. But still. There we are. Yeah, let's have a quick, uh, quick look-see at you. Let's have a quick look-see. Command every 15 seconds. Oh, that is brutal. Love the design, though. Then suddenly, shell armor. Whoa, surface ceiling at 327. Wow, that looks weird when painted. Okay, so jumping over to the outro, which discusses the shell armor. I apologize for that. Thank you for watching. Goodbye. So let's see how powerful this thing is. So let's open up the lovely Derp Dart Jr. Let's remove all lift. I said remove all lift. Thank you very much. So now we're at minus 61. Nothing is causing us to float. Now let's replace all of the armor with shell armor after having a quick look see at the stats. So steel wool, which is what we're using currently, is white 2, absorb 5, blast, absorb 3, piercing, 27 HP. Shell armor is 45 HP, so that's much better, although it is, whoa, it's over four times the cost. 
for just over, sorry, just under double the health I meant to say. Weight-wise, it's three times heavier, but it provides 22 lift. It also absorbs two blast damage and two piercing. So overall, for its, especially for its cost, it's not really any better than the steel wall. The extra HP is nice though versus more basic weapons, but still, okay, let's fill it all together and it almost floats. It almost floats by itself, and if this craft wasn't using a ram, which is really heavy for its size, I imagine... Yep, it does float. So, will I be using this? Yes. The reason is, it means we can start making craft with very little lift outside of the armor. And honestly, it's not that much more expensive, especially on something like this. If we go back, so this is the original. It's 383, without the lift again. Now it's... Okay, yeah, it is actually a bit more expensive than I thought it was. Um, will I use it? I think I will still, yeah. Just because the lift sections are always the more vulnerable sections. You don't really want too many of these, for instance. The pressurized tanks. And two of those, and that's a decent ceiling. Whereas without the armor, we would need more. I think I'm going to need some time to think about this and where this is going to become applicable.